Hey superstars, it's your girl Malika aka Ms. Magic back with another video. I am finally getting up out of here. I am leaving the country and I'm going all the way to Mexico, Cabo San Lucas to be exact. So yes, we are still in a pandemic, but the world is opening up and I'm flying right on up out of here. I want to take you guys along. I want you to come pack with me. I'm going to show you how, what I pack, how I pack, and then the extra precautions I'm taking for the pandemic. So before we get started, if you are new here, welcome, welcome, welcome. Thank you for coming. I'm a hairstylist and I do lifestyles and travel. Yes, and I thank God I'm back on travel. But uh, I hope that you check out some of my other videos, stay a while, and please subscribe, like, and comment. If you are returning back to my channel, welcome back, Magic Superstars. All right, so since we got that out the way, come on, let's get started packing. So first, we're going to start with our toiletries. I'll start from the back to the front. And trust me, it seems like a lot, but it's all going to get packed up nice and neat. I have, um, first I have my Aussie shampoo, conditioner. I got some um, bug spray in there. And then right there is my contact lens solution for my contacts. And then I got like a little misty spray that I get from the dollar store. And that is for bathroom. After you use the bathroom, you spray a little bit. Then I have my uh, Bath and Body Works Japanese Blossom, which I really love. Body wash and lotion. And then I have my Johnson's lotion because I get ashy and I need that. Well, that's the oil. I need that. And then I have, uh, what we got? Hand sanitizer, my um, acne treatment pack, pads that I use for my face, deodorant, definitely got to have the sunscreen. A lot of people think that dark skinned women do, or and men do not get sunburned, but we definitely do. So you have to have that. Got a pack of cotton balls, alcohol, two razors, another hand sanitizer, little travel lotion. I got some mouthwash. Bar soap, I like, I do have a body wash, but I definitely like my bar soap. And then toothbrush, I always like to take a new toothbrush on vacation. And then a travel toothpaste. I got some makeup remover. And these flushable wipes, you knew what, you know what these are for. Flushable wipes after you come out the bathroom. Well, not after you come out the bathroom, while you're in the bathroom. And that is the, it for the toiletries. Now on to the makeup. I really do not wear makeup, y'all, but I am going to be experimenting on this trip. So I got a whole, I bought this from a little uh, pop-up shop, Live Love Lipstick, and I've been buying little lip glosses, and then I have my other lipsticks that I have, and I got some NYX lip glosses, and my MAC, of course, my favorite, okay, and then just basic makeup stuff that I just randomly bought, two blushes, I, uh, all my all makeup brushes, some other makeup brushes, some uh, blending sponges. I'm going to be wearing um, lashes. I haven't worn lashes in a few years, but I'm going to wear them for this trip. So I got that. I got a lip liner and eyeliner. And then just some more brushes over here. I got some, of course, br uh, highlighter, bronzer, whatever. So I, try I bought a few different kinds. And then um, I wear my press-on nails. So I already have the press-on nails that I'm going to wear. In another room but just in case they pop off I am bringing two different sets and of course nail glue nail glue so and then I've got these little cute little mini uh, blending sponges that I'm going to use so that is it for the makeup on to the hair okay so for my hair products it's basically going to be uh, protective styles ponytails wash and wears whatever so I got my my trusty dusty Dollar Tree gel in here a travel water bottle in here and then a little edge control in there. And then when I'm at the beach or out and I want to touch up my ponytail, I just put a little bit of gel in here so I can just throw it in my boot bag. Oh, I forgot. This goes on the other side. My Japanese uh, Cherry Blossom Fragrance Spray. That goes with that. And then just bobbles. Just, I, I bought this from the dollar store. Just um, some ha more hair gel. Something if I want to put some twist in my hair and I want to get a little design. And then I got clips, rubber bands, combs, scrunchies, uh, bobby pins, colored bobby pins, rubber bands, hair pins. And that is that for the air. And, and I got a little cookie for the airport, y'all. Don't, don't judge me. That's, that's for the airport. 
And of course, a satin bonnet. We need, I got some extra hair clips. And then I got a, um, a, a hair wrap for when I wash my hair. So that is that for the um, hair. And then I got two little cute little purses, um, uh, waist purses. This is going to be for the airport. Of course, my passport is already in here and my wallet. So this is a fanny pack for the airport. Fanny pack with the passport. We're going to keep that in there because the trip is in a couple of days. And then these are the bags that I'm going to put everything nice and neatly in. I will show you. And then I've got my little um, cam pack, which is like a, a GoPro. All my camera equipment is there, the waterproof thing. So I'm going to take this whole box, put the camera in there with the batteries, and then I don't know which um, selfie stick I'm going to wear or use or whatever, but we'll figure that out. Oh, I want to show you all this. And it's cute. You know, we're not supposed to be drinking the water or ice in Mexico, but so hopefully the resort will be okay. But I bought these little ice cubes from Burlington. They were one ninety nine. And you just stick them in the freezer and you don't have to worry about ice. They'll be frozen. And I think, no, that's not it. Let's go on to over here. I'm going to be putting my makeup in this little bag underneath here. I always put, uh, separate the makeup into baggies. So I do that. Let's move this card out of the way. And uh, so stuff, you know, stuff, how makeup is, it comes out, spills out. So everything that is actually makeup will be in baggies. And then I've got all my little sunglasses right here. I'm taking about four pairs of sunglasses. I got my Pradas. I got my Gucci's. Where are my Gucci's? Oh, I think I put the Gucci's in the car. Yeah, okay. Yep, I got the Gucci's. I got the Louis in here. So that is that. So we're going to... Oh, one more thing. Um, I am going to Mexico for my girl's birthday. So I bought some little balloons and stuff. So I want to make sure I have everything to decorate the room. I got scissors, a Sharpie, tape, invisible tape, duct tape. So whatever I got to do to hang the directions with, uh, hang the um, decorations, I should have. Hopefully you will come to me, with me on the trip and see what I do for the room. So this is going to be my carry-on bag, just a little book bag. And here's my little hair pieces and everything in there. And then I just got a few extra stuff. Like I always take a outfit that you're going to wear just in case your room isn't ready. So this is like a little dress that I'm going to put on when we get there from Pretty Little Things. You can see me try that on in my Pretty Little Things haul. And then I got some slides and um, I got uh, some visors for the sun. And then I'm going to throw a, a bunch of other crap in here too. But that is going to be the actual carry-on bag. Just remember, don't ever put uh, more than three ounce bottles in your carry-on bag or they will confiscate it. I also got... Um, I want to show you this too. I use these. These are compression socks because I have a problem with swelling. So I put, I take my shoes off and then I put my compression socks on. And this helps for your feet and ankles to not swell. I got these from Walmart. They're called compression socks. Little thing, um, Dove lotion, dental floss, a fan because it's hot in Mexico and I want to look cute. And um, I got my waterproof uh, camera case for my camera. And then, of course, masks, masks, masks. This is my Silk by Miss Magic Mask. And because we are going to Cabo, let me show you this cute little mask. Okay. And these are the masks that I had made for the trip uh, for my girl's birthday. Cabo Crew Birthday Behavior. So those are our masks for our trip. We'll put those in a plastic bag. And that is my uh, carry-on. So now, oh, and in here, I really mostly wear all my jewelry with me. But I am going to bring a couple of pairs of earrings and um, a couple of fashion um, necklaces and bracelets just in case we go out. So, yeah. Okay, so this is how everything looks all packed up. Um, er some of this will go in my carry-on and some will go, most of it will go in my suitcase. I don't know if I mentioned the uh, very important in this uh, COVID pandemic time and first aid kit. So I have alcohol pads in here, sterile pads, band-aids. Um, quick cleaning sponge, insect re uh, sting relief uh, things. I got a bunch of crap up in here just in case something goes down. So I didn't mention that. That's very important. And then I didn't mention my earbuds. I got my earbuds for my music on the plane, my tablet uh, with Netflix and everything on it. So we're good to go on that. And then I have my, um, my wire for when my earbuds run out. All right. So that's pretty much everything that is... Um, 
toiletries and makeup. So we're going to go to the clothes. Okay, on to my suitcase. So pretty much in here is all my sandals, my gym shoes. I forgot to put my ATV shoes in there. And then in this suitcase is just all my little clothes that I will be wearing day, night, nighttime. I got a couple pair of heels, uh, wedges that couldn't fit in that other one. Dresses, shorts, little dresses for breakfast. This is my airplane ride outfit home. Um, and then this is like a little linen outfit. And then I got my, oh, my ATV outfit. This in here is right here. I got to pack it. Little ATV outfit that I'm going to wear. I'm going to put that in there. And then I got two suitcases. The other suitcase is just my swimming suits, cover-ups, um, underwear, bras, you know, stuff like that. So now we're just going to pack our um, toiletries on top of that. Oh, and also I take bubble wrap. And when I go, I'll put the bubble wrap on top of my toiletries. But I really use the bubble wrap for, um, like, souvenirs if I bring back glass or whatever and I want to uh, wrap it extra. If I bring back some liquor, I want to wrap it extra. So I always take bubble wrap. I'm going to show you, once I get all my toiletries on top, how I actually close my suitcase. All right, so this is me with all my stuff in my suitcase. If it looks like I pack a lot, I do. I'm a girl. I like to have options. So, those are both of my suitcases, and then I have my book bag that's a carry-on, and I'm fully packed and ready to go to Cabo. All right, guys, so that is me all packed up and zipped up. Don't come for me with my old-ass luggage. If it ain't broke, don't fix it. So, make sure you have your TSA locks. You can get these from Walmart, Target, or anyway. These are pre-approved TSA locks to lock up your suitcase. I want you guys to tell me what you would have done differently in packing. Did I miss something with this pandemic going on or am I packing too much? But I don't ever think I'm packing too much. So let me let me get, let me know in the comments below. OK, guys, I am all packed up. I'm ready to go. I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like comment and most of all subscribe and hit that notification bell so that you can see when I post other videos because like I said I'm about to go to Cabo and I'm going to vlog the whole trip so I hope to see you guys in the next video love you guys bye this ain't over.